This idea started out as a collaborative project with Jeff Bradshaw of Elderly Iron. If you haven't seen Elderly Iron and you aren't subscribed, you really need to. Anyways, he wanted to know if we could set up a rig to spin up a bearing, a wheel bearing, and make it explode with compressed air, mimicking what a lot of guys do when they dry off bearings with compressed air and then have them come apart like shrapnel. Well, I thought it sounded like a heck of a good idea. So I made up a rig out of the old uh, exploding record roulette's tub and mimicked the situation. Bearings cleaned with mineral spirits. Then we give it a try. sort of set the tone for the evening. I tried lubing them up with mineral spirits again. No bueno. I tried lubing them up with a little bit of gear oil. Nada. I checked them for temp and thinking maybe they were getting hot and seizing. Nope. Cool to the touch. I even swapped out the old used bearing for an identical brand new one. No change. When I check the high speed, you can actually see the bearing chattering on the race. If you look closely, you can see it start to oscillate and wobble. And that was what I was assuming it's doing. We're going to try the whole thing again laying flat, but the night wasn't a total loss. We did get something interesting. Now, when it came loose, I'd flip the bearing around. I had, uh, you know, put the small side out rather than in. I actually thought the air would blow it on, but it here it did start to oscillate, and then you can see it drop down and, and take off. I don't know, man. I know I watched online and other folks get their bearings to explode, but we had it do this twice in a row where it would come off, and both times I had it, you know, put on there, essentially backwards of what it would be on a on a spindle. It hopped around and did this instead. Sounded really cool. That's sort of where we are. Jeff, I will get back on this probably by the weekend, and I'm going to try spinning them up flat. Maybe the bearing's too big, but it looks about the same size as the ones we watched explode. I don't know. I'm throwing it out there for ideas and suggestions. Best I can come up with, try it laying down flat.